One of the key things of the Crucible, I think, is about the way a simple lie can start to get blame off yourself and then the lie builds and builds and builds and you have to catch up with it. It's so deeply embedded in you that God is real, the devil is real. And that fear, I think, is really palpable. And so as the lie grows, it becomes a reality for them. Mm. It's really happening to them. I mean, there's that, there's that beautiful thing about children as well. They don't, they're not yet grown enough to, to sort of have formed their own um, mind up about their value systems yet. So what of whatever they've sort of grown with is the thing mm. that they go to. The sporting and the drama of it, because they're living in such a small community and I wonder, well, they don't have much to look forward to. So I think when the opportunity arises where they can create some havoc. Truth is a really slippery concept in the crucible because of belief. Um, it's not a rational, logical society all the time. Um, and particularly for my character, Mary Warren, she's navigating very treacherous waters where um, there's truth on one side and the other and lies on both and, and trying to pick a side in a sense. And everything is gray. Nothing's black and white.